The sentence, if surfs dot 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 estate lines 10 and 11 has which of the following functions in the passage? So let's start here with answer choice A. It provides support for an argument presented in the preceding sentence. The preceding sentence states that Russian serfs were able to get around landlords' rules and regulations. That's lines 9 and 10. And then this sentence, beginning with if serfs, provides support for this preceding sentence. So that's perfect. Exactly what answer choice A says. Answer choice B, it provides evidence that helps undermine a view introduced in the first sentence. Undermine means to weaken or go against. And the view mentioned in the first sentence is that Russian serfs were very limited in terms of their economic growth. That is, serfdom meant you could not grow economically. So what's happening here, this is examples where, well, wait a second, serfs are actually able to pay for passport, they can move, passports, they can move around, etc. So this does support, or sorry, rather does undermine the view in the first sentence, the idea that they can go around and get passports. And then finally, C, it raises a question that the seceding sentence will resolve. The seceding sentence reads that, oh, they could also, if they could pay a fine, they could also establish a separate household and they could, you know, if they had resources, they could hire laborers, et cetera, et cetera. And so all of these sentences are just giving further reasons, such as passports, why the Russian serfs were able to move around, why they weren't inhibited. But however, the seceding sentence does not raise a question that this issue resolves. So C is not the answer. And again, A and B are the ones that are correct.